Hey what's up guys my name is Norton and in today's video we're going to be taking a look at three different easter eggs to do with Michael DeSanta. I spent the entire evening compiling three of the best and the most secret easter eggs to do with Michael DeSanta and smacked them into this one video so if you do enjoy this video then a like would be very much appreciated and I do recommend you subscribe to my channel so you'll never miss out on any more Grand Theft Auto 5 content every single day. But in no particular order let's get straight into the first easter egg. So for those of you guys who have googled the name Michael Townley, you may have seen something like this appear alongside the front page. Michael Townley was an American professional assassin currently living under the terms of the US Federal Witness Protection Program. Now Michael Townley has since been renamed and given a new identity just like we see in Grand Theft Auto 5 because during the prologue Michael's original name was known as Michael Townley until he stages his death and renames his identity to Michael DeSanta. Regardless of this coincidence Michael Townley looks very similar and alike to the real life Michael Townley who we can see on the screen. Leaving us to only decide this must be one of many easter eggs Rockstar Games hide beneath Grand Theft Auto 5. Now moving inside Michael DeSanta's house, let's take a look at a few picture frames which we see at the end of his bed. Now a few of you guys, including myself, once thought that this picture frame was Michael DeSanta's parents, however on the other hand this picture could also be Amanda's parents. The reason why I say this is because Michael's father abandoned him as a child and his upbringing wasn't the best or the most decent that you would get in an expected household, which means that Michael would not essentially be able to take a picture of his dad and his mom together and as you can see in this image this is something recent which was taken maybe a year or so ago. Something which Michael would never be able to get by himself. So this picture could either be sent by his parents, which according to quotes in the game, Michael misses dearly, hence why he's got a photo of them above his bed. Or it could just be Amanda's parents and they could just be there on display, just like you would see in a normal household. And last but not least, Michael DeSanta follows the exact same traits that we see from Max Payne as well as Red Dead Redemption for both the main characters. So if you want to try and play both of those Rockstar created games, then go and check out both of the main characters and try and relate them as closely to Michael DeSanta as possible and I promise you the personalities and traits as well as appearance may even match up or become very very similar and may even turn out to be spookily and creepily similar as you may have thought it was. But guys if you did enjoy this video then a like below would be very much appreciated. I do recommend you subscribe to my channel so you'll never miss out on any more Grand Theft Auto 5 content every single day. I hope you learned at least one thing in this video. I tried to put together three of the best easter eggs to do with Michael DeSanta and I just hope it did help you out at least at some point in this video and if it did let him know down in the comments and let him know other easter eggs about Michael DeSanta down in the comments as well but guys my name is Nort I hope you did enjoy and I'll see you all next time